guys, this is Katrina, also known as Carolina Curls, and I'd like to welcome you back to my channel if you're an old time subscriber, and I'd like to say welcome if you are new here. And in this video, I'm going to be trialing some new styling products released by Pattern Beauty. Um, the company released these products on Juneteenth, which is also known as June 19th. Um, they do have like a shower phase or a shower um, collection, and it included um, shampoo and conditioners um, but this time she's actually releasing the styling portion of the wash day so um, I'm just going to go into um, the two styling gels that I purchased um, first of all this is what the packaging looks like right here has the little packing little things right here um, the little um, the little information card right here and of course my packing slip um, this is the color of the tissue paper and the little tag right here says juicy and joyful so I am just going to go ahead and show you the um, curl gel this is the shine define and hold and as you can see I got the three fluid ounce size because I wanted to see how this gel would work for my hair before I committed to the larger size. So the details for this curl gel, it is a favorite for wash and goes. It is a dream for defined, bouncy, and juicy curls looking for a medium hold. Um, the creamy smooth formula glides on effortlessly and gives life to coils with the nourishment of aloe vera, coconut oil, and KK oil. And so the fragrance of this curl gel is that it is a clean and not overpowering scent. Um, notes are a sweet floral essence of neroli, rose, and patchouli. So the suggested use for this curl gel is to apply on wet hair for wash and goes, braids and twist outs, or on damp or dry hair for a slick look. All right, so that is the curl gel, and this size was actually $9. Um, the larger size is $25. So the next product I got was the Stronghold Gel, and this is what that looks like. And as you can see, I got the smaller size in this as well. This is actually a three ounce size as well. So according to the website for this strong hold gel, it says that it's never damaging or drying and it has a long lasting hold without breaking your hair or edges. It's infused with sea moss, aloe vera, and chia seeds to nourish and fortify your curls. Um, it says that this texture has a glorious, luscious, built-in slippage to easily distribute through the hair. It's ideal for a slick look of your choosing and styles that need extra support. Um, so the fragrance is also the same fragrance as the curl gel. And it says that the suggested use is to apply on wet or dry hair and style into a slick look. And I also purchased some other products as well from the website, but I will show you guys that at the end of the video. I wanna go ahead and get into these stylers and see how they work for my hair. If you're interested, I've already shampooed, deep conditioned, and added my leave-in conditioner in the shower. And of course, I had to use the Pattern Beauty products. I used the hydration shampoo. I used the medium conditioner for curlies. And I used the leave-in conditioner here. So like I said, that is what is currently in my hair. So my plan for these two stylers is to go in with the curl gel first to see what type of hold it has and how it eliminates the frizz on my strands. If it does not eliminate the frizz like I like, then I'm going to go in with the strong hold gel on top. So um, we are just going to go ahead and get into the video. I'm going to take my hair down and let you guys see what my hair is looking like with the leave-in in. This is what it's looking like. And so I'm just going to go ahead and section my hair off, start in the back as I always do, and let's get this 
styling process on the road here. Okay, so curl gel here. And let's see here, this is what it looks like. Looks kind of stringy. This is what it looks like. Very creamy and it does have, you know, some slip to it. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply it to this section here. And immediately as I am adding this curl gel, like it does have lots and lots of slip, y'all. It is clumping my curls somewhat. Um, going to go in with some more of it. So when I went in with the um, extra amount the second time, like I can see that it is clumping my curls. It didn't totally eliminate the frizz on my hair as you can see. There's some right there. And as I'm adding the curl gel, like it is smoothing the section down, but once I let go, like the frizz is starting to come back. And I will say that as I am rubbing the curl gel on my hair, I don't know if this is just because of the amount of leave-in that I use in my hair, um, why the extra amount is coming off onto my hands. Um, it could be me just being heavy-handed with the products. So I'm just going to go ahead and continue to add this curl gel to the rest of my hair. And I'm just going to play it by ear as far as if I'm going to add the strong hold gel to my hair as well. If I do, I will definitely let you guys know. So I am finally done applying this curl gel to my hair and right off the bat I will say that you do not need a lot of this product on your hair. Um, my curls are really defined and as far as that little frizzy section I had like in the beginning on this side, like I'm not really worried about that. Like I was comfortable in just applying the curl gel to the rest of my hair and not adding the stronghold gel. So um, this is what my hair is looking like. As you can see, like there is still some white residue on my hair, but hopefully it will, you know, go away once my hair has completely dried. So while my hair is air drying, I wanna go ahead and show you guys the other things that I purchased from the website. It is their edge control and it says that you can swoop and stay as you lay. This is what that looks like there. And this is actually a four fluid ounce container. I'm just gonna unscrew it so you guys can see. It has this little, whoops, this little lid here on top of it. But this is what it looks like. And it's very tacky, but smooth at the same time. 
looks like. And I will say like the smell smells really good. It's like a fresh scent. Um, let me put this lid back on there. And I don't really use edge control. I just bought it um, for my daughter because she is all into laying her edges. Um, and the next two products I got were the Jojoba Oil Hair Serum and it's Self Heating Packs. It's for a moisture boost for hair and scalp. And this is what it comes in, this little box here. Um, it actually comes with two of the self-heating um, packs. And this is what it, they look like. And basically what you do is you just tear um, the back of this off and it will start heating itself. And I believe the website says it takes like three minutes for it to activate. And um, I thought these were like really cool and like I don't even like really use oil on my hair like that. But you know, seeing these and the fact that they're like self-heating kind of made me want to just try it just for the fun of it. But like I said, I got two of those. And another thing that I absolutely don't really use, but was just, you know, like had to get type thing was this um, hair pick. And this is what it looks like. Like that is just like so unique and cool. Like I just couldn't really pass it up. And you know, like I said, like I really don't pick my hair like that, but I just wanted it anyway. So let me just open that up and show you guys what that looks like. And it comes in this little velvet case and it has like pattern across it. And this is what it looks like. Like I can tell that this is like, you know, high quality. Like just look at how it looks. Like isn't that cool? And it actually has like a little, um, circle here i'm assuming that's for you know for you to rest your finger in while picking um but yeah i didn't really need it y'all but i just wanted it um but yeah that is all that i purchased from there and they do have like other styling tools as well um like the um pattern beauty brush like i do use that brush as well detangling in the shower like it's a really good brush um, and I think they have like satin ties and bobby pins as well on the website. I will put the link down in the description box so you guys can just check out everything that they have. The next time you'll see me, my hair will be dry and you know, we'll see how I like this curl gel for my hair. So just stay tuned. Okay, so it is the next day and my hair has completely dried. Um, I slept with my hair in a scarf last night and um, when I woke up this morning, like my hair was like really shrunken. I had a lot of shrinkage. So this is why I put these silk ties on my hair to, you know, band it and kind of stretch it a little bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and take those off right now to see if it helped any. And I will say that um, yesterday as my hair was drying, like I did feel like a slight crunch with this curl gel. So I was pretty, you know, pleased with that because I know it would give me like, you know, some type of hold. And um, so this is what this section is looking like now. And it does look like it did stretch it some anyway. All right, so I'm going to take this side down. Okay, so this is what my hair is looking like. And it has, you know, like I said before, it has stretched it some um, to an amount that, you know, I'm pleased with. I will say that there are some sections of my hair that are um, frizzier than others, but I'm not really like, you know, surprised or feeling some type of way about it because this is a curl gel and it is for medium hold only. 
but I will say that my hair is really, really soft. I don't have like any flakes or anything. So if you are looking for a gel that is giving you like a soft hold, but still have curl definition, I think this curl gel will be, you know, perfect for you. Um, like I said, I got this three fluid ounce size just to try it out. But honestly, I think I could probably get another use out of this. As far as the strong hold gel, I will try that next on a wash and go on its own, well, along with the leave-in too, um, but just to see what kind of strong hold it will give me, even though, you know, it's geared towards like slick down styles. I don't think I actually showed you what the curl gel looked like, but I'm opening it up and it has this little lid as well. And this is what it looks like. And as you can see, it's actually a clear gel and not yellow. That is just the packaging's color. And it has the same scent as the other products. Um, this is what the consistency looks like. It's a very thick gel. It's not tacky or anything. This is what it looks like. Very thick. So if you do want to see my thoughts on the Stronghold Gel and how it works for a wash and go, go ahead and like this video so I can know that you guys want to see it. Um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please go ahead and do so. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.